In this video, I would demonstrate the spiral from element command. This command is located from the geometry categories, horizontal, and spiral. I'm going to select spiral from element. I have a graphic in my design file that I want to use as my start point. You can use any point, but I have a graphic that I want to use. This is not going to be my offset, but I do want to use it as my start point. One of the first things I like to do is set my feature definition. And I'm also going to add a name for my spiral. Notice on my prompts, my first prompt is to look at element and look at my center line. Offset, I do want an offset of minus 12. So I'm going to left click to select my offset. And I have a prompt for my starting point. Now, once again, my graphic here does represent the starting point, but not necessarily my offset. So I'm going to snap to that start point. And I now have my spiral created. We can also edit this spiral if need be. Currently I have a spiral in radius of 90. If I want to edit that to 100 I can do so. And we also we can also edit the spiral length. 